Greetings, night time here. <laughs> Pandora and I are at the Adelaide Botanic Gardens. We'll be going inside in a few minutes just to have a bit of a look around and I'll show you what we have to offer. Okay, you can probably hear traffic going past. This is because the Botanic Gardens is actually on one of the main streets of Adelaide. But if have a look over here, you can see the uh, cars, traffic, Botanic Hotel across the uh, street there. One thing said for the Botanic Gardens here is that traffic aside, it's quite a peaceful place just to sit down, have a rest. So once again, we've got Pandora here. Maybe we should have a um, little platform like just stick her there and she can just see everything that's going on. <laughs> Alright. Behind me, you should see a stand of trees which are thin and fairly tall. I've been told that um, these sort of trees we use, are used by Aboriginals to make spears. I can believe that, even if it wasn't true. The uh, photographs I just took was of the Willam Willamy Pine. Apparently it's what was called a living fossil. As in, in the fossil record, there are pines, the same as this, including the fruit, uh, the, uh, the leaves or fronds, everything. So this is actually a living fossil. This is the plant equivalent of a dinosaur walking across the street. So here we are at the Amazonian water lily display. Uh, we'll be going inside in a moment. Uh, well, 
Why don't we go inside now? <laughs> So here we are in the Amazonian water lily ex exhibition. Let's see if you can actually see me. That's a bit better. So let's have a look around, shall we? Here we have the lily pond. It's actually quite warm and humid in here, which should match the um, climate that these lilies are use, used to. We'll look down here. You can see a flower starting to bloom. Here we can see Pandora sitting on one of the leaves. It gives you a bit of an idea of just how large they are. I'll get into the frame as well so you can have a bit of a better look. So as you can see, I'm not exactly a small person. And these are not exactly small lilies. Or lily leaves. Because the Amazonian water lily enclosure is both warm and fairly humid. The Botanic Gardens has taken advantage by planting other plants which also like warm and humid uh, conditions. We'll have a look at some of those in a moment. Let's have a look at some of the um, petals here. You can see one that's just gotten through the surface. There's a young one that's only just unfurled. And the rest are all of these fully unfurled and collecting sunlight. So, Pandora and I are in Victoria Square in Adelaide. As you can see, she's having a bit of a uh, rest by the fountain. A bit further away, seeing the bigger picture, so to speak. I'll just show you around the square a little bit. Here 